Hey everyone, we're playing Pokemon again. Um, really, really quickly, we just have to finish up this route. We got just a couple more Pokemon to catch, and then we'll make ourselves in... We'll make our way into the cave. Um, but first, we need to get, um, a couple Pokemon. Chingling, Nidorina, and then both forms of Nidoran in Hordes. Um, so I'm gonna quickly look for those, and, uh... Oh, okay, there is the Nidorina. So, that is one of the two that we still need. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and quick attack it, and I'm hoping it doesn't die. I for okay, I, was, I forgot last night if uh, the Nidorino died. Of course, poisons me. Your butt. That's okay, though. Um, I'm hoping we can now catch it quick, though, because I am getting slowly poisoned, so... Let's go ahead and try to throw a Great Ball at it, and again, hopefully we can get it very, very quickly. I don't feel like uh, being hurt for a while. Alright, well, not the first ball. But that's okay. Keep throwing some balls here. That's what she said. Alright, another great ball. And if this one doesn't work... Well then, I don't know. I'm gonna be real angry. Not really, but... Come on. There we go. Ah, okay. I was like, eh. I have a habit of uh, saying, here we go, thank you, and then uh, it jumping out at me. Okay, we only got poisoned for like two rounds, so I'd call that a pretty good. The female has a gentle temperament. It emits ultrasonic cries that have the power to befuddle foes. All right, cool. So now we just need one more, which is the chingling. Once we get the chingling, we'll start doing hordes. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, here we go. Okay, I'm like listening to something on my phone and Chingling pops up. Alright, Chingling. Do me a favor and don't die. Ooh, okay, that was close though. Okay. Making an uproar. Now, why would you do something like that, Chingling? I thought you were a good Pokemon. Alright, so after this... We just need the two small ones, and we then we're good to go to run inside that cave. Okay. Each time it hops, it makes a ringing sound. It deafens foes by emitting high-frequency cries. Very, very cool. Okay, now time to hoard up. So use moves, we sent. And again, we're just looking for, um, two neater ends. This is gonna probably take a minute, to be honest. Um, it's because I gotta knock out, like, five of them every single time, and I don't have a mass move. Um, and I accidentally attacked the female, I would have already had the female, so. Um, wait. Yes, I do want to learn Mega Drain. Yes, I want to... Get rid of acid. Yeah, acid is just not a super, super good move. I'm gonna do that. Oh, and also, um, in between episodes, I went ahead and healed, obviously. And I also put away Pelipper and I put away Curlia. And I went ahead and I grabbed, um, uh, whatever you just saw there that leveled up and something else. Alright, cool. Thank you, Nidoran female. Yeah, I grabbed two other Pokemon to evolve. I totally forgot what they were, but there's something. Alright. Although small, its venomous barbs render this Pokemon dangerous. The female has smaller horns. Alright, now we just need the male. Ooh, Oddish is evolving. Now we just need the. Male ver uh, yes, the male version. And again, I could probably do this through breeding, but... You know, with, like, the Eevees, it's gonna take, like, hours. I'd, you know, Eevees probably better to do eggs, but... With this Pokemon, I could very easily just get it done now, so... Congratulations, your Oddish evolved into a Gloom. I'm actually very tempted to... Evolve Gloom right away. Do I have a leaf stone? I I do, but I only have one. 
And I think I'd rather use it for... Hmm. Yeah, I am not going to do it now. I would personally rather use it on Roserade. Wait. Um, hold on. Roselia Evolution level. When does Roselia evolve? Exposed to a shiny stone. Oh, it's not a leaf stone. Alright, well then, we're gonna go ahead and we are actually gonna evolve the gloom then. Um, first, let's just go ahead and catch the neater and mail, but then we'll probably go ahead and just evolve that gloom. The thing that sucks is I'm technically not gonna have a reason to keep it around anymore, but, um,. You know what I might even do, actually? Um... Ooh, don't... Of course, the poison's gonna kill me, isn't it? Hmm... That's just slightly annoying, but no problem at all. Use next Pokémon. Let's go and bring in Whirlipede. Maybe I will run into the cave, grab that... Mime Jr., and then stick Wild Plume back. Next, we're gonna go to Shallow City. Route 12. Yeah, but I'm gonna need it later anyway. Um, maybe I will just keep it around then. Dude, come on, man. I could hurt it. But I'd rather not. I'll just, I'll just keep chucking balls. I have a little bit of money with me right now, so I'm not too, too, too worried about it right now. Thank you. There we go. Yep, there you go. I'm like, hold up. Keep it good, though. Okay. We have officially caught all of the Pokemon on this route. It only took another 15 minutes. Skins its surroundings by raising its ears out of the grass. Its, to its thorns are toxic for protection. All right, and while we're at it, we might as well leaf stone the gloom and get ourselves a vile plume going. That way, when we use sweet scent, you know we can do it with Pokemon. Like, yeah, we got a vile plume. Um. Yeah. Here we go. Vile Plume. I like Vile Plume. It's one of the exclusives in uh, Gen 3, so. Dive Ball. Nice. I've got one of those right there. Okay. I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, let's go ahead and enter the cave. No biking or skating. Okay. All right, first encounter, what do we got? Chingling, the thing we were just looking for. I guess they also appear in this cave, so that's cool. Don't need it, so we're going to go ahead and just run from it. Is there, like, something in this rock? Nope. All right, another encounter. What do we got? Wobbuffet. Alright, that's one of the 10%. It looks like there's a lot of psychic Pokemon in this cave, which is very interesting. I'm going to try to round it. I'm. This might actually kill it. No, it doesn't. Alright, Destiny Bond. Does that mean we can't run? Alright, let's go and throw a Great Ball at it. I bought a few more Great Balls. Hopefully, it doesn't... Wow, that was very quick. Mirko. Alright, well, here we go. Here's another one. And we'll start throwing Pokeballs too, just because um, we gotta use those. Okay. Alright, safeguard. That's fine. That's not gonna safeguard you from my balls. Alright, let's start throwing some Pokeballs because we're gonna, we're gonna have to use the stockpile here. Alright. It looks like Great Balls didn't do the trick, but Pokeballs seem to do the trick, so maybe... Maybe we gotta stick with throwing Pokeballs. The Great Balls seem to be not working as well. Alright, well, if it's Dado, it's added to the decks. 
It hates light and shock. If attacked, it inflates its body to build up its counter strike. And we did grab a female version of Boba Fett, so that's interesting. To tell you the truth, I'm thinking of never leaving this place. Well, we should probably leave it eventually. Uh, backpacker Lane. Also, again, it still surprises me that all these trainers, you know, are like in a place like this where, like, man, why don't you catch yourself a Mr. Mime or, uh, I don't know, a Reg and Rolla, you know? You only got the single thing? Like, really? I mean, fair enough, I guess, but seems kind of weird to me. Psych up. No, he doesn't need psych up. Yep. Tell you the truth, I'm not even sure if this place is real. Well, it sure is, bud. So I just fought you, so... Okay, um... Is this whole thing like a maze? Is that like the deal? Well, hopefully we'll catch- Ooh, a horde battle of Regan Rolla. Uh, actually, I don't feel like taking on this many of them. I'm gonna go ahead and- Okay, I'm like, hello? I'm gonna catch Regan Rolla in a normal encounter, not in a horde one. Alright, we got ourselves a revive, and I don't buy those because they're expensive, so it's actually like, extremely useful currently. Mr. Mime? Okay, that is the one of the more common spawns of this place. So we will do this. Now, round once again. Wubba Fett has really high defense. I don't think Mr. Mime does, though. He does. Okay. Well, that's perfectly fine. Um, put up a light screen. And actually, I really like Mr. Mime. It's another one of my favorite Pokemon. Obviously, it's probably because Gen 1, but... Um, it also tends to be caught really easily, which is also very nice. I appreciate it when Pokemon do that. Therefore, Mr. Mime is cool in my book. Alright, Mr. Mime uh, was added to the decks. Emanations from his fingertips solidify the air in invisible walls that repel even harsh attacks. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Question, do I go up or down first? Oop, I would say I go up first. And an encounter. What do we get? Solosis! Now, am I tripping or did I already catch one of these? No, I have not caught one of these. Okay. I thought for some reason I, I did. You gonna like counterattack me? Ooh. Ooh, that almost killed it. But since we got into the red, I think it's safe to say we could probably just use a Pokeball and call it a day. One, two, three. Bonk. Cool. You love to see it, you love to see it. Greninja's level 41. Because their bodies are enveloped in a special liquid, they are fine in any environment, no matter how severe. Very cool. Alright, we found a nest ball. I think that's for birds, right? I don't know how many birds we'll be catching in the future, because most of them you catch early game, but... That's cool with me. I'll take a nest ball. If I ever, for some reason, run out of balls, I'll make sure to use it. Um... I don't want Regan Roll off. What? Shadow behind me. Must have been the outside. Um, I do not want a poor Regan Roll I want a normal Regan Roll Also, you gotta fight me. Bump, bump, bump. Alright, Battle Girl Hedvig. Alright, Hedvig. Oh, she's gonna have a hawk and a sock, huh? No, no, not a hawk and a sock. A throw, a throw and a sock. Um... Yeah, I think Water Pulse would just be the easiest here. It's not a super effective, but... Oh, wow, I did kill it. Ouch. Okay, fine. You're gonna be gone pretty soon. Why are you not dead? Let's do a quick attack. 
Maybe I'll try a SmackDown for the next for the next one here. Yeah, these fighting types hurt, man. Even like at level 41 and early 22, they still actually kind of hurt. Alucha. Is it? It's not a flying Pokemon, is it? Either way, let's go ahead and just do a SmackDown on it. Okay. Ooh, that, is that gonna kill me? It's because it was a critical hit. Of course it's a critical hit, dude. Alright. Um. Whirlipede. Time for you to shine, bud. Um. I'm gonna do a pursuit. Aerial Ace. Oh, that's a bug Pokemon. No! But. Ah, uh, you suck, dude. Get poison. Okay, that didn't hurt that much. But you're poisoned at least. How am I like losing so fast? Another aerial ace. That will kill me. Man, these battles like aren't hard, but like they're like slightly hard. Um. Spring in Gulpin, I guess. You know, if Gulpin just gets a little bit of XP, that wouldn't be the worst thing on the planet. Let's go ahead and use Strength. Ah, it's not gonna kill Gulpin. He's fine. There we go. And the poison should kill it. There we go. Alright, Gulpin got some XP. And the rest of the team also got a little bit of something something. So you're the strongest trainer. Okay, and Gulpin's evolving. Which is kind of good timing because I actually got to run back to heal, but might as well get Gulpin he uh, evolved and grab something else while we're out there. So that's actually really good timing. Perfect, perfect timing, Gulpin. Appreciate that, actually. Thanks, my job much easier. Alright, why am I calling you Gulpin? Your name is not Gulpin anymore, it's Swalot. He do be Gulpin, but now he be swallowing. Um... Sure, let's just get rid of Yawn. Just because I'm already in the text box for it, so... Alright, let's, uh... Whoa, we got two evolutions! Okay, I... Didn't realize Snubble. Actually, yeah, that's why I grabbed Snubble because Snubble I saw was like a level or two away from evolving. So, all right, perfect. Well, we can swap out two more then, which is really really nice. All right, we got ourselves a Grand Bowl, right? Grand Bowl. Grand Bowl. Yep. Very nice. Also, you and I should maybe do. Um, we'll probably have an encounter or two on the way. That's fine. Alright, maybe we can grab something new real quick on the way back. Nope, we already got one of those. I should probably make a box for things that are, like, fully evolved, so we don't, like, um, you know, keep looking at them as, like, something we could potentially evolve. I need to, like, separate the fully evolved out of it, you know? All right, let's go ahead and um, make our way back to town very quickly. Okay, let's grab Esper here, and then we can grab one more Pokemon. Um, what's like an easy one? What is Ducklet? Um, what about Ducklet here? Ducklet. When I totally spelled, I put an F instead of the D on Google. Alright, 35, whatever. Let's go ahead and grab uh, the ducklet here. And probably heal and we'll head back. Can you right where we left off here? Um, Alright, reg and roll up. But only a single one, not a big horde. That's what we were looking for here. Um, let's go ahead and round it. The Reganrola has very high defense, so I'm very sure we won't kill it. That was close, though. 
ironically, everything that I think I'm not gonna kill, I don't get anywhere close, and the things that I'm like, oh yeah, I, like, definitely won't kill this, I almost end up killing. Um, very, uh, ironically. What? Regenrola? Cool. And actually, um, Regenrola might be a Pokemon that I grab right after... Whatever evolves next, Reg and Roll is I'm probably going to put in. Its ear is hexagonal in shape, compressed underground. Its body is hard as steel. Very cool. Okay, what is this? Oh, okay, we already checked out that way. Oh, yeah, because we didn't came down here and fight. So we got, um, we call Mr. Mime, Reg and Roll, Solosis, Chingling. We got a couple of Wubbuffet. So we really only need Carbink. And Sableye. We already have, I think, both Pokemon for shaking areas. Okay. It's like a weird spotlight here. Alright, Wobbuffet. Another female Wobbuffet. I do not need you. Oh, really? Okay, well... That's very weird of you that you won't let me escape, but that's fine. And then we'll quick attack you. Hopefully the defense isn't... Okay, I was like, the defense isn't that good where it won't even die from a quick attack, right? Alright, Vile Bloom to 23. Spoink to 18. Nope. Spoink does not need that. Okay, let's go grab... Whatever this is. Hey, that's not a bad thing at all, actually. Um, I needed one of those. Carbink Sableye? No, just a Mr. Mime. Um, I don't really know where else to get Moonstones. Um, because of this game having so many Pokemon, probably quite a few evolved from Moonstones. And, um... I don't know how many are available in the game, or if I can, like, even buy them. I'll have to double-check later. Um, okay, so as I thought, we do have Pharaoh Seed. I really wanted to double-check if I had Pharaoh Seed or not. I thought I did. Um, but, of course, it's better to double- double-check. Instead of just assuming. Alright, um, Reagan Rolla. I do not need your bud. You can actually go away. Not need ya. I will fight whoever this lady is, though. Ace Trainer, I don't know about all that. I just love Pokemon. Yeah, they're pretty cool. Ace Trainer Monique. So what makes this lady specifically an Ace Trainer? Is, is there something that she did? Can I become an Ace Trainer? <sighs> oh, man. Alright, that's for the 12. Helio Helioptile. That's pretty cool. I got one of those too. I think the evolution of Helio. Hel oh. Um, okay, I can't hit it with water. Noted. Um, I'm gonna give it a smack down then. I like the evolution of Helioptile. Okay. Oh, I got a new alarm. I forgot. I set an alarm for me to do something just now, and I'm probably not going to end up doing it today. I'm probably going to end up doing it tomorrow morning, so that alarm is slightly useless. for Guru 13. Light screen? I think so, actually. Um... Actually, let's just get rid of Scratch. No? Leer. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's get rid of Leer. I might actually have... I, want, I might want to keep Scratch on there so he has some form of attacking move. Not like it matters, because we have the XP share, but still. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and get Aerial Ace 2... I'm gonna just get rid of Defog. 
and learn Aerial Ace. And yeah, I don't think I'll ever use Ducklet either, but as a fellow Pokemon lover, you're an ace yourself. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Whirlipede is evolving. Okay, well, I thought that evolved much later, as usual. Um, we can probably grab Regenrola now, but it'll be a little while. I know we get to a town right after this cave, so I'll probably um, hold on to... I don't even actually know its name. What is it? What What is your name? Scoliopede, yep. Scoli oh, Scolipede, yeah. Scolipede. Very cool Pokemon, by the way. Um... What about... What is Pass Baton? Oh, okay. No, I don't want to do that. Um, very cool Pokemon, though. Definitely one of the... Um, cooler bug types, in my opinion. I, I really I really like it. What does it say? Okay, anyway. I do like uh, that Pokemon. I'm not gonna even bother saying its name. Um, 